so we win. All right, the random Loki off Helicarrier. Let's go. What's up, noobs? I'm Greer. This is Greener Gaming. Log in and let's go. Okay, so today we're going to be playing a Helicarrier deck. Um, and this is a discard Helicarrier deck. Most decks that run Helicarrier are pretty garbage, but this one's actually pretty good. Helicarrier fits pretty well into this uh, discard shell here. So let's go through the deck really quick. We're running Meek in here after each turn. If you've discarded any cards, gain plus one power for each and move. I didn't find that Meek was winning me a lot of games, but you know, he's a little bit of additional power if you need him. And we're gonna be discarding a bunch of stuff during the course of the games. We're running Blade in here. On reveal, discard the rightmost card from your hand. So if you see that you have Helicarrier, you can discard it with Blade, or you can use this on Apocalypse. We're running Morbius, ongoing plus two power for each time you discarded a card this game. Uh, Morbius was winning me the games most of the time because he just gets so big sometimes. We're running Wolverine. When this is discarded or destroyed, regenerate it with plus two power at a random location. So, I mean, he's only ever getting to four power, but just a little bit of extra spice for discarding your hand. We're running Swarm in here. When you discard this, add two copies that cost zero to your hand. Also pretty key, especially if you have, uh, if you discard it with like Corvus, then you discard it again with um, Modok. Speaking of which, we have Corvus Glaive in here. On reveal, discard two cards from your hand to get plus one max energy. Um, I found that Corvus was really good in this list because if you discard Helicarrier and you have that uh, plus one max energy, sometimes Helicarrier gives you a bunch of really cool cards and uh, you can play them out early. We're running Lady Sif in here. On reveal, discard the highest cost card from your hand. Um, so the two targets that you want to use Lady Sif on are either Helicarrier or Apocalypse. We're running Swordmaster in here. On reveal, discard a card from your hand. Um, you probably want to play this after Helicarrier gets discarded uh, just because he's six power and the cards you get out of Helicarrier, you don't really care which one gets discarded. We're running Hellcow in here. On reveal, discard two cards from your hand. Again, this is a great way to pump up your Morbius. Um, if you didn't get Modok, it's a good way to discard your Helicarrier and it's just a solid eight power. But of course, we are running Modok in here. On reveal, discard your hand. Um, he's a solid eight power. The best time to use him though is when you have stuff like swarm apocalypse and wolverine in your hand that's not always going to be the case sometimes he's just going to be eight power we're running apocalypse when you discard this put it back with plus four power so like you can discard this with blade then again with lady sif then again with modok so apocalypse can get pretty beefy and like i said we are running helicarrier when you discard this fill your hand with random cards and if you have the um max energy from corvus you get some good stuff out of helicarrier you can really surprise your opponent so that's pretty much the deck by the way if you're new here why don't you hit that subscribe button for a guy huh hey it's just a click for you it means the world to me all right let's get into the games okay let's chill We go Morbius here and we hope they don't have um, Enchantress. Play out Corvus. They have Ravona. This is probably a tribunal list, which is why they snapped when they saw Onslaught Citadel. Yeah, it's for sure negative tribunal. Although now I can play out Miss Marvel. That's pretty good. And then maybe we could Loki. So it's not negative tribunal. It's negative destroy. So we go blade Loki here. That's a three. This is a four. 
a six and a one. So far, so good. Um, well, I think we null Mystique here and just toss out an X-23. Wait. Maybe Mystique over here is not the best idea. Null Mystique. X-23. I gotta hope they destroy something here to pump up my nulls. So we win. All right, the random Loki off Helicarrier. Let's go. I guess we chill here. I guess we go. Corvus. I hope they don't have a Shang-Chi. I mean, I could just Modoc here. Too bad I don't have Swarm in hand, though. Hit him with arrow here. Clear for takeoff. Um, I kind of like Morbius Lady Sif. I was ho really hoping that was going to hit Apocalypse. To me, Invisible Woman usually means... What? Like a tribunal kind of thing? How big are they going to get is the question. Because I could just go Apocalypse Meek. And then what? Hellcow Ghost to try to pump up these two lanes more than the Tribunal can uh, can get. I'll play it out. Forgot about that. I am Iron Man. Oh, it's Hella. That's not so good. Minions to me. Behold my mighty hand. 
but we got over that's pretty spicy dude Okay, let's chill. And we hit him with uh, Morbius here. Okay, I gotta hope that Corvus doesn't hit Modok. And then we can go Modok here. Pretty good hand for Modok. Well, they could have Shang-Chi. Do I play out Apocalypse now? Because they can't Shang-Chi two places. Okay, Shang-Chi's gone, so mid's probably fine. Okie doke. Do we think they're going to move stuff to New York? I think maybe we go... Um, Lady Sif. And just toss out some... Some swarms. Lady Sif discards Wolverine. Which gives us a buff somewhere. I can put Corvus over here. All right, let's see it. Set, Just blob mid. And blob mid almost didn't even win. Pretty good, man. Okay, we'll be blade here for sure. Okay, we go Morbius here. I guess we play Meek. Really sad that I didn't get Corvus or Lady Sif. Wind my hand. So they're playing Lockdown. Uh, we go Lady Sif here. Hope that it hits, what? Helicarrier maybe? I mean, I could Modoc here to uh, buff up my Morbius. I just really need Pryo on the final turn.
Did I just lose Pryo because of Meek, dude? You've got to be joking me. Please don't have... What's his face? Please don't have Eliath. That's Eliath. They didn't have it, so we win? All right, dude. Okay, let's chill. Uh, TVA is not great. Maybe we just play out Wolverine. Or maybe we can chill for Corvus to see if it hits Wolverine. So let's go Corvus here. I was really hoping that was going to hit Helicarrier. Um, I could go Swarm Swordmaster. I hope this is enough. And it is. Victory. Um, I think we chill here. And we can go Morbius into cloning vats. And then we can go Morbius Meek. Um, I think I risk it and go Hell Cow here. It might discard Modok, but at least we'll have another Hell Cow. Since we can only play one card at a time anyway, we go with the other Hell Cow. Um, okay, I guess they uh, couldn't keep up with the Hell Cows. Okay, chill here. We play Morbius. Maybe we play him over here. Because we're going to have a full hand anyway because of Helicarrier. Then we go with Lady Sif. They probably have Eliath in this list, so we need to get Pryo. Um, 
Um, I think maybe we just go wave. Wave and blade. And then we play out Modok. Hopefully they don't play Eliath here. Well, I have Pryo anyway, so I guess it doesn't matter. Bit awkward. So I think we go here. I don't know if this is going to be enough to win mid though. Um, or maybe it is. <laughs> so while playing this deck today, we went 12 and 8, which is a 57.1% win rate with a plus 6 cubes. I mean, it's not the best deck on the ladder or anything, but it's still pretty good. I mean, over a 55% win rate. Pretty strong if you ask me. But the main thing that I like about this deck is the chaos that happens when you discard Helicarrier and uh, Corvus. So then you have a bunch of energy to play with and sometimes Helicarrier gives you like really good cards. Sometimes it gives you really not good cards. But I like that whole RNG aspect of this deck. It makes it a lot more fun for me. But hey, don't take my word for it. Try the deck out for yourself. Tell me what you think about it in the comment section below. Hey, if you like this video, why don't you click that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell. And anyway, GG.